wanted to uh, just share with you guys. I don't think I shared it last week. And uh, if any of them are tuning in, they're going to go bananas. Or maybe they see this on Twitter and they're like, oh, shit, there it is. That's who it is. Hey, 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 it's me. I uh, wanted to let you guys know. Officially, got me a little lazy lion cub. <laughs> Look at that guy. Look at that guy. <laughs> little, little chef wizard with a little eye. It's supposed to be see, but it's some kind of candy, obviously. But and, and he's red. He's got the, I mean, just the reds. The reds are different colors and the shadowing on it it just looks so good i mean it just looks so good so i had to uh let you know i got a little lazy decided to get a little lazy and uh wanted to make sure you guys saw it so uh didn't uh show it at the end of last uh last week i don't you yeah, know i definitely didn't so just wanted to show you guys hey shout out the uh lazy lines i like I, I like what they're doing over there they just passed one year they're very very strong i know a lot of Blue chip holders are involved in the project as well. A lot of uh, the rhinos started getting involved. So I started asking some questions and uh, decided to just dip my toe in the water. Uh, don't have the ends at the current moment. Soon will to uh, get involved with the old OG collection. <laughs> but uh, if I can make a couple of rip flips and dips, eh, who knows? Who knows? But right now, we got a nice little lazy cup. Word on the chain has it. Item. Number three, uh, if you didn't hear us talking about this yesterday on uh, the second breakfast, shout out Ferk and Grandolph, uh, lazy, what, no, I'm looking at that. Grandpa Ape Country Club Greenskeepers, goodness gracious, all Friday, Cap. I mean, I just went like, just dead. I had nothing. Holy shit. We talked about this yesterday, but uh, in case you guys haven't heard it, you didn't read anything on Twitter Wanted to give you a little update on the NF Tiffs that I talked to you about, the Tiffany and Company and CryptoPunk collaboration. Um, essentially, anyone who uh, purchased one of those bad boys, we already talked about uh, how much it was worth and the 250 size, 50 set aside, 200 public, yada, yada, yada. Anybody who purchased one of those bad boys for, reminds you, 30 ETH, uh, basically signed over their full IP rights to Tiffany and Company. Uh, full sale, full everything, and now the owners of those crypto punks have no say in the matter, whatever. So essentially, they paid 30 ETH for this pendant and uh, basically to sign away one of the biggest, uh, you know, I wouldn't say the biggest, but a, a major factor of a lot of people owning NFTs. They have full IP rights, license that JPEG and utilize it in some form of business where it's a recognizable image and people are drawn to that, right? So very interesting. Uh, I, I put my tinfoil hat on yesterday, said, hmm, I don't know if maybe they knew about this. Maybe there's something more coming in the background. Who knows? But honestly, if I paid 30 ETH and just gave away all my IP rights, I'd be pretty bummed out. The biggest deal about all this, too, is they don't even get the pendant for another six months. So they got to sit around and wait around uh, for Tiffany and Co. to make all of these. And uh, it's not going to be sometime till sometime next year. So there you go. Want to give you an update on the NF TIFFs. Uh, let me get over yonder here real quick and do one of these numbers. Get out of here. Let me do this. Let me do that. Word on the chain has it. Item number four. The CEO of Cameo. That's right. That Cameo that once made the Island Boys, because we some Island Boys rich, uh, now completely fucking broke, um, has, his, has reportedly said his basey was stolen. His board Ape Yacht Club. That's right. CEO Stephen Galanis of Cameo has reported that his basey has been stolen. Did I know that Stephen Galanis was born in Glenview? No, sir. Did I know that his ENS name was Mr312.eth? No, ma'am. Had not a clue of any of this. So I dove in to the basey floor, the most recent sales, and wouldn't you know, the seventh most recent sale, the seventh from the recent one, is this exact thing. So, my friends, on your screen now is the former ape of Mr. 312, Basie 9012. Uh, pretty badass. Obviously, he had a toga. Uh, let me see if I can go out just a little bit. Yeah, obviously, he had a toga. Uh, but, oh, shit, I'm obviously covering out. Uh, toga, 3D glasses, uh, purple, black, and then a board unshaven. So, I mean, that's that's a bad, that's that's badass. So, you say, well, what the hell? What the hell happened? So he bought this for 
um, r- roughly about 320,000 and it sold for 130,000. Hey, shout out, uh, Mr. 312. If you're seeing this, man, I'd love to have you on the show. You see, <laughs> you see, you see the Willis Tower, uh, no, the Sears Tower behind me. Yeah, hey, shout out, boy. Yeah, everyone, come on and talk. Uh, but I dove into the recent activity and I was like, holy shit. So, Toga sold this to Mr. 312 seven months ago for 100 ETH. You can like this, you can see all of this. Transferred it. His his shit's flagged, which I, it just doesn't make sense to me for some reason. But I I don't know. Explain it in the chat if if somebody has any any fucking clue why. I I think it's because his it was his NFT that got fucked. But you can see him transfer it to like a burn or not a burner, but like a a, a cold vault that's off the map. Uh, you can see it transfer back, maybe to verify, transfer it back again. All the same stuff. You can see it right there. It's all good. Fast forward to now. Oh, shit. <laughs> I didn't realize I had that on there. Uh, but you see three months ago and then two days ago. This literally just happened two days ago. So he transfers it to another what appears to be cold wallet, I would say. Transfers it there and then back to himself. So when it's here on himself, then I don't know what he signed here. This is what I'm very interested in because this DCC 10E is gone. You click on it, it's a 404 page not found. It's gone. It's done so. You don't have it. And you see here, a Weath offer of 77 ETH was accepted. Monroe St. James is now, shout out Monroe St. James, whoever that is now. But this DC DCC 10E has been done so, gone, over with. Um, so, I mean, hey, Monroe St. James, Mr. 312, who knows if something's being worked out in the background. If not, who has a guy? Who knows? Um, but obviously took a major loss on that. Um, but it's just it's crazy to be able to see what actually happened. Um, so if Mr. 312 does get back his uh does get back his board ape, would love to have him on the show and love to talk some shop with him about all this nonsense going down. But there you go, there you have it. Word on the chain has it item. Number five, Coca-Cola has uh, officially announced the full details of their uh, friendship uh, friendship day, National Friendship Day NFT. I told you guys about that uh, a couple of weeks back. Uh, it was just before it dropped on July the 30th. 